Welcome to Faustian Chocolates, my friend. May I help you with something? <laughs> it is alright. There's no judgement here. Do you want flavours of success? Luck? Love? Lust? Mm-hmm. You were just curious and wanted to get a set for yourself. Of course, my dear, of course. Please, have a seat on the fainting couch there, and I will create perfection for you. Oh, I don't need you to tell me your favourites. Trust me. Let me just grab my tray and gloves, and I will be more than delighted to demonstrate my skills. After all, I made everything here with all the passion and care I could muster. I adore seeing how customers react to tasting them. Won't you be a love and humour me, just a bit? Wondrous. Wait right there, and do help yourself to some of our blueberry seltzer, if you'd like. Yes, a bit of this. A mix of dark and light. Mm, a bit of cherry. There we go. Yes, they are quite pretty once completed. Now, let me just don these gloves and... There we are. Open wide, my dear. Trouble? You do not want to be a bother? My friend. We cater to our customers with the utmost precision and care. Feeding you chocolates is very much so my pleasure. Now, come on, open your mouth. A swirling of milk and white chocolate with faint traces of butterscotch and tart apple. One of my more experimental pieces. How is it? I anticipated you'd like that one. Which means I'm doing a very, very good job at pleasing you. Oops. Phrasing. <laughs> now, how does it make you feel? Safe. Interesting. Now, this one. Another fine piece. Dark chocolate with cherries and a light coating of orange zest. A very refined but refreshing piece, I would think. And I'm most glad to hear you like it, dear. How does it make you feel? Giddy? Hopeful? Hmm. What an interesting response. Then again, when you walked in here, I got the sensation that you have a kind soul. A good heart. <clears throat> now, the third. Well? Infatuated? Ah, there we go. That's a bit more predictable from that particular chocolate. Hmm. May I ask a favour of you, dear? I'm happy to offer a discount in return. I want to taste you. Oh, goodness. <laughs> so flustered. I didn't mean it like that, but it's nice to know I'm not hideous. <laughs> no. What I do is take a touch of someone's essence, what makes them, well, them, and convert it into edible form. I want to taste you so I can know you. You walked in here because you were curious. Bored. Looking for a little adventure, and far more calories than one could devour in a week. But here I am, offering to show you something completely unique and rare. I'll show you without getting any closer. All I need from you is for you to blow a kiss at me. Why that? I don't make the rules of magic, my dear. Just try it. What's the harm? Ah, caught it. Now watch my left palm. See? It's already forming. Oh, and look at how beautiful it is. How did I do that? Well, my dear, sometimes you have to make deals with the devil in order to be the best at your craft. Now, what do you taste like? My unusual friend. What in God's name? This taste. 
No, it doesn't taste like sweatpants that you should really throw out, or a desperate desire for naps. It tastes... beautiful. Free, but blanketed in sadness. Hopeful, but strangled by stress. Just wanting some control, some passion, some danger. Oh, you would do anything to protect those you love, wouldn't you? You're delicious. Oh, I think that you are that delicious, my dear. No need to be embarrassed. My thanks for allowing me to explore you so intimately. To be inside... Inside your mind. <laughs> Dirty little brain you have. Would it make you feel better if I offered the same vulnerability to you? After all, we're having a moment, aren't we? A crazy little moment of two strangers being vulnerable with each other. Hmm. I'm glad that you're so open-minded, my sweet. I had hoped you might be open to the idea. I knew the moment I saw you that it would be a perfect offering. Everything I am as a woman, as a chocolatier, is encased in that last chocolate on your tray. I suppose you could say I... Made it with love. Here, let me grab your tray. There we are. What do you say, my sweet? Can you be brave for me? It's alright if you're afraid. I can put it away and you can leave with what you like. There's my brave new friend. Open wide. How do you feel, my dear? Oh dear. You collapsed into a quivering, shaking, drooling mess of errant lust, darling. Was the taste of me that strong? Well, I mean, I guess I'm not human, so... Fair. <laughs> Why do you want me so badly now? Well, I'm a succubus, my dear. Oh, you had a succubus roommate and she never made you feel this way? Huh. I suppose you've never felt the essence of a succubus that's just become... fascinated with you, though. Have you? Dear. Don't look at me so pleadingly. For now I need to taste you more, so I can catch your entirely unique captivating taste. Here, let me pick you up. Oh, poor baby. Is this too much adventure for you? <laughs> oh, poor little baby. Got on a ride you want to jump off of now, did you? You little humans really ought to be more careful. Fortunately for you, you've become my new... Fixation. Now, be a pet and let me fixate, won't you? <laughs> <laughs>